Welcome to Module 2, Cloud Data Center and Virtualization. In this module, we will give you a behind-the-scenes look of a data center and the various technologies that power up the data center. One such key technology that is powering modern data center and cloud computing is virtualization. So as part of this module, we will discuss and spend a great deal of time on the architecture, types, implementation, benefits, and trade-offs of virtualization, concentrating heavily on server virtualization. After completing this module, you will have a decent idea of what happens behind the scenes in a data center, especially in cloud computing. And when you ask for a server or a storage or network load balancer, how it is really provisioned so rapidly for you. What are the topics in this module? As part of this module, we'll start with the cloud data center technology, where we will look at the various technologies that are powering the data center, more from the physical characteristics of a data center. For example, the server and rack system, the cabling system, the network system, the power and cooling system. Then in the section on data center two, we will look at several small videos that give you a behind the scenes look of the operations behind a data center. Then we will get into virtualization. Virtualization is a very important concept for modern data centers and cloud computing. It is the technology that enables cloud computing. As part of that section, we will define virtualization and the various types of virtualization that are out there. And then in the next section on server virtualization, we will concentrate on server virtualization there are several types of hypervisors that make up server virtualization. So we, so we will look at different types of hypervisors, type 1 and type 2. And then in the section on virtualization features, benefits, and trade-offs, as the title suggests, we will look at the various advantages and disadvantages of virtualization. And then finally, in the last section on cloud computing and virtualization, we'll try to bring it to full circle and show you how other kinds of virtualization like storage virtualization and network virtualization enable cloud computing. What are the module goals? Describe the features and activities of a cloud data center. Define virtualization, especially define server virtualization and compare and contrast the two types of server virtualization, type one and type two hypervisors. Then we will also characterize the attributes of virtualization. We'll also discriminate the benefits and the drawbacks of virtualization. Every technology has both benefits and drawbacks. We'll look at that. And then we'll correlate how virtualization connects to cloud computing. And then as part of the exercise lab, you will be doing a hands-on lab using a type two hypervisor. 